Today we're going to learn about bonds to 10. Our decimal number system is based on the number 10. This means that it repeats its pattern in groups of 10. So the first 10 numbers look like this, and then the next 10 like this, and the next 10 repeat the same pattern, and the next 10, and so on, and so on. So if we want to do a calculation like 6 plus 4, we go 7, 8, 9, 10. And we get 6 plus 4 is equal to 10. But in exactly the same way, if we want to do 26 plus 4, we'll get 27, 28, 29, 30, getting 26 plus 4 is equal to 30. So knowing that 6 plus 4 is 10, tells us that 26 plus 4 is 30, 56 plus 4 will be 60, and 76 plus 4 will be 80, all following the same pattern. Similarly, if we know how to calculate that 5 plus 3 is to equal to 8, we immediately know that 25 plus 3 will be 28, and we don't have to do any work to discover that 95 plus 3 is 98. So knowing the tens makes a big difference to how quickly we can do calculations. And that's what we're going to focus on today. We're going to make sure we can make up tens. And we're going to practice doing this using a little frame with 10 spaces in it. This frame allows us to see, for example, that we have three dots in the frame and seven dots missing. So three plus seven will make up 10. But we can also see from this that seven plus 3 equals 10, and get two facts related to addition. 3 plus 7 is 10, and 7 plus 3 is 10. But we can also see that 10 minus 7 will give us 3, and that 10 minus 3 will give us 7. So we get our fact family around 3, 7, and 10. That 3 plus 7 is 10, 7 plus 3 is 10, 10 minus 7 is 3, and 10 minus 3 is 7. We need to know the fact families around 10 very well. And to do this, we're going to practice today by playing two games. In the first of these games, you'll play a game with the 10 frame cards. You'll open this next on the middle, and in this game, you'll choose the option 3, fill, and play the game. Once you can do that fast, you'll move on to a fun game where you match pairs of numbers that make 10. 